are clearly not a particular fan of uh, the Republican nominee, Donald Trump, uh, and I think the feel feeling is mutual. Um, why do you think the race is so competitive? I mean, if he is, as you depict him, a racist fool, that's kind of how you depict him, why is Hillary Clinton, why is this going to be so tough for her to, to, to win? Shouldn't she be ahead by 10 or 15 points? Look, um, uh, the way I see this is that Donald Trump has tapped into something that's real. There's a lot of anger. Something that you country. talk about all the and time. And I was just going to say, yeah. it's real because the game is rigged against hardworking people. The game is rigged against young people. The game is rigged against a lot of people who have done their dead level best, who've worked hard, who've played by the rules, and just see any chance at economic security way outside their reach. And he's tapped into how angry people feel about that, rightly angry. The problem is Donald Trump's so-called solution just heads us in the wrong direction. And, and so what we've got now is Donald Trump says, yeah, I get that you're angry, and let me tell you what's wrong. It's them. It's the people who don't look like you. It's the people who don't worship like you. It's about immigrants. It's about uh, Mexicans. It's about women. It's about everybody else. It's about them. Donald Trump is about turning people against each other and telling America that's the way we're going to build a future. But he also blames trade deals, a lot of the trade deals that you have concerns about. But always look at then what is Donald Trump's solution to that? He's just not offering anything. He's, 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 he's just empty at that end. He's got nothing to say, here's how a plan, here's how it is we build a future going forward. What he's got is a bunch of uh, secret ideas that he just doesn't want to have to tell the American people about.